Raise your hand if you know who Walt Bettinger is. Walt Bettinger. Because I hope nobody's heard this. This is my closing story. And this wraps it all up for me. Walt Bettinger is the CEO of a very small financial company, Charles Schwab. They've made a few deals. Okay. He was a... Finishing up his undergraduate in business, he had a 4.0 grade point average. Of course, he went on to, with a graduate degree and, of course, now he's CEO of one of the most uh, successful financial companies in the world. But he was getting ready for one of his last final exams. And he walked into the classroom and the professor came in and he had a stack of papers and he handed everybody one sheet of paper. And it was blank. They're all going, what the heck's going on here? Professor said, ladies and gentlemen, in the 12 weeks that I have been with you, I have tried to teach you everything that I know about business. You may turn your papers over now. Oh, good. Blank. He said, I have one question for you. You get the question right, you pass the exam. You get the question wrong, you fail the exam. One question. All right, bring it, bring it, Mr. Professor. Write down the name of the cleaning lady in our business building. Walt said, man, are you kidding me right now? He said, I probably passed that woman a thousand times. Might have nodded my head. Never spoke to her. Never introduced myself to her. Never said, hey, you do a great job cleaning our building. I appreciate what you do around here. And he failed that exam. Wrecked that 4.0 grade point average. He still passed the class, but he didn't get his 4.0. But he said, that was one of the most important things I ever learned in business. Is that everybody matters. And he said, oh, by the way, her name was Dottie. And I have never in the history of my career failed to know the name of every Dottie in every building I've ever worked in and made sure that they knew that they were right on top of the heap. That's what it's all about. Because ladies and gentlemen, you got this and you got this. That's an S, right? That's an S with two lines through it, right? Better known as a dollar sign, correct? Okay, here's the problem. Those two lines right there, sometimes they blur this. Y'all know what this S stands for? Somebody tell me. Take a guess. Service. Service. Okay. These two lines right here, though, that S is right there. But those two lines blur your vision, they blur your purpose. They blur what you really, really need to be concentrating on. You take those two lines away, you've got an S. If you concentrate on this right here, this will take care of itself. Promise you. One of the guys that I love listening to, his name's Ed Milet. You guys, you want a man's man? Go look, listen to some Ed Milet YouTube videos. M-Y-L-E-T-T. Very successful entrepreneur. He just bought his own island. He said, man, I own an island. Is that crazy? But he's very humble. He's an incredible man. And he's just coming out with a book. It's going to be out next month. It's called The Power of One More. And I close with this. Everything that I've said today, I just want to wrap up with this. You are one conversation. One text. One phone call. One encounter away from changing not only your life, but the life of someone else. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Thank you guys for, for your time today. I appreciate you listening. Good job, bro. Appreciate you. Yeah.